Raleigh's historic landmarks has a new purpose this morning. The Raleigh Water Tower on West Morgan Street is now home to an escape room. What a setting. The stone and brick structure was built in 1887, served the city for 40 years, and was later converted into offices. WRL's Claudia Rupsich and photojournalist Daryl Pryor are in the tower trying to escape right now. Claudia, tell us the progress. How's it going? You've been there a few hours now. So, yeah, good news. We made it out of the first room. We are up on the second floor of the water tower, and this room is even cooler. We've got a compass, we got some ropes, so we have no idea what we're doing with this. But what's really cool about the tower escapes here in downtown Raleigh is that it's just this, this historic landmark. About 1924, this water tower was abandoned because the city built a brand new and bigger tower. And eventually an architect came, bought the tower, added some offices to the building and converted it into an office space for architects. And so since then, it's just used for office space. And about a year ago, the owner of this place, Val, bought it and thought this is the perfect place for an escape room. And it really adds to the feel of it. You can feel the history in here. This is all original stone and it's pretty cool that it's about 140 years old. Now what's not cool is how difficult it has been for Daryl and I to figure out these clues. We've got block boxes, diaries. I mean, where do you even start? We don't know. So everything in the room is a clue. You just gotta get creative and you gotta think outside the box. So that's what we've been trying to do. And by eight o'clock, we are getting out of here. Mark my words, one way or another, we're getting out. So we'll see.